Good afternoon from a blustery Beale farm as we're back to our trials again. Uh, two weeks since we were last year, two to three weeks since we were last year. As I remember last time uh, we just drilled the crop and we're just sort of seeing it, the first sprouts there. As you can see now the crop is nicely evened up and is sort of one two leaf stage which, which is good. The, the, the plants have germinated nicely, putting down a really good stru root structure. We've got some really strong roots there with some nice adventitious root hairs coming out the side there. So that will allow them to access nutrients, water. Um, so, you know, despite the late start, still really happy with how these crops are establishing and can move on from here. I'll get on about weather a wee bit. It, uh, you know, these wind conditions are really drying the ground out, so pains me to say it, but we could do with a little bit of rain, but, and it warming up a wee bit, but that's my commentary on the weather for the minute. So, what have we done since the last time we were here? Not a really an awful lot on, has been going on with the crop. The only thing we have did, once it got to two leaves, like it is at the minute, we've actually rolled it, and you can see that the seed bed's nicely consolidated down there, pushed down any stones, broken up any clods, and also as well, this will hopefully help the crop to tiller on a wee bit as well. So at the minute, yep, happy with how the crop's uh, started, you know, despite the late start on it all. Varieties, I'm stood between Laureate and Diablo here. Uh, what we've been looking at, Rosie's been down and looking at uh, the various speed of establishment and uh, how, the, how, how quick and vigorous the crops are coming through the ground. And we've noticed not huge amounts of difference. You'll see somewhere in there that uh, Golden Promise stands out a mile. It's very, very upright and uh, was first out the ground as well. But that is to be expected of the variety. Uh, not a lot of difference other than that. The one thing that we're going to be monitoring, and hopefully this will come to light this next week or two, is the various seed treatments that we used as sort of biostimulant root, root growth promoters, and we'll be monitoring the root mass on them uh, over this next week or two. So, what am I going to be looking for this next uh, next wee while? Hopefully we'll get a bit of rain on it, and we'll see a flush of weeds, and the crop will really start and move on a wee bit. So, yep, and, and come back in a couple of weeks' time, and hopefully see the crop meeting in the rows and covering the ground.